Hey everyone, welcome back, Jojo. Shruti, कैसे हैं आप? हम सही हैं बिल्कुल, बहुत बढ़िया. आप कैसे हैं? ऐसे कैसे? हम sleepy हैं. ऐसे कैसे? See, that's natural. Don't ask. I know. That is lovely. Now that we milk the title puns enough, let's. कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे लिखता कागजों पे जो लिख रहा बादलों पे मैं कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे आज भी मायरों में से तंगे नादतों से मैं सफर ये सिफर से करोड़ों में अब खर्चे आरों पे घटे बर्चे पाते हैं अब हेली गुजरेंगी तेरे सर से लोगों की अब आंखों से ही आदतों को पढ़ते पैसा मेरी तलाश में बल्ले मैंने आलात ये वो जले मेरी याद में दबी पड़े ये फासले वजन मेरी हर बात में नशे से अब तो भागते वो भागे मेरे पीछे क्या एक इसमें तक की याद से दबा रही मुझे ये जिम्मेदारियाँ चला रही मुझे मेरी ये यारियाँ खुदा ने मुझे मेहनत का सिला दिया लोगों के लिए खड़ा हूँ खुद को मैंने क्या दिया सारी रात बैठा सोचता रहा सर अपना नोट सारा कंधे पे ये बहुत सारा दिलों में खौफ भरा कैसे हो रहा है गुजारा लोगों का कभी तो सोच जरा मुझे सड़कों पे ढूंढ नहीं मैं बारिशों का बूंद नहीं काश होता मैं मशहूर नहीं इज्जत बड़ी पर सकून नहीं अलग मैं इन सारों से करता बातें अवतारों से क्या ही संभालोगे मेरे दिल का हल भला तुम क्या जानोगे कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे लिखता कागजों पे जो लिख रहा बादलों पे मैं कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे आज भी मायरों में से तंगे नादतों से मैं क्या सुनाऊं मैं कहानियाँ क्या दिखाऊं अब आसानियाँ रास्ता तो दिखा दिया मुझे बदले में क्या दिया सब ढूंढे मुझ में खामियाँ फिर भी चलना सिखा दिया लोग मुश्किलों से भागते रह कि ये सबके खाब पूरे खुद तो रातें जागते रहे कभी इन बातों पे ध्यान तो दे मेरे लव्स मेरे साथ सो रहे यही मेरा साथ दे रहे आशिकी के चेहरे मुख्तलिफ कला पुकारती है वक्त की कदर है बेसबा बना बिगाड़ती है दरे या तो आग के भी पार किए क्या करें फर्क लोगों में दुनिया को मिसाल दिए ना दे वन लुक लाइक मी वन फ्लो लाइक मी डू लुक लाइक मी मेरे ये मेरी सीधा कराची से केली हाथ हाथ गाने रेडी आसमानों में और डेली उर्दू रैप की हम फेस आईडी लिखने से पहले अपनी फीस आएगी वैन फुल अपे न खुला बारो नीड आई डी तेरी कीमत से ज्यादा की मेरी वीड आएगी बेअदब सही तो कभी बद इखलाक भी बेकदर कभी और कभी नगे बान भी रैप मेरा हार्ट जाना यही मेरी हार्ट बीट यही मेरा घर यही मेरी जायदाद भी कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे लिखता कागजों पे जो लिख रहा बादलों पे मैं कैसे समझेगी ये दुनिया फिर मुझे आज भी मायरों में से तंगे नादतों से मैं on the guitar the music was amazing probably joke like hai absolutely hai. amazing mm. yeah joke has been doing this a lot right like mm. this last time i think also we discussed right it yes, wasn't spanish it wasn't latin but it was like thoda sa inspired kuch to chal raha hai mamla yeah. so which was which is amazing it was really nice is gaane mein i was so focused on what he was talking about and what he was speaking that mm. i was fully focused and i was totally like with him listening to everything he's saying and you know when he said ke uh, um I wish I wasn't famous. 
कि अगर मैं फेमस नहीं होता एंड आई वाज लाइक रियली लाइक वुड वन लाइक यू नो डज ही रियली विश दैट ही वाजंट फेमस एंड ही कुड डू समथिंग एल्स बिकॉज़ वन स्ट्राइव सो हार्ड टू बी वेयर ही इज टुडे राइट एंड एवरी सो मेनी ऑफ देयर सॉन्ग्स वी हर्ड देम से दैट हैव यू नोटिस दिस लेटली सॉरी टू कट यू ऑफ हां नो नो टेल देम देयर वाज अ थॉट दैट अ लॉट ऑफ द सॉन्ग्स वी वी हर्ड दिस वीक आफ्टर कमिंग बैक Um, be it forty song or divine song or you know it's all are all the artists having a mid career crisis like you know they are all like I alone. Unki bhi break chal rahi thi. Kisi ko bhi pata nahi hai what I'm going through after becoming famous. You know like sorry. <laughs> it's just a recurring theme. Mean. Are you feeling that? I am. I am. I feel. It's the season. You. <laughs> it's the season of that. And the first thing I noticed was that the artwork and the visual, like a little bit whatever, was blue. And then just you and I also in blue. And we were like, we're just so meant to like listen no. to the song. We're all color coordinated. So yeah, I was just like cheap thrills. Oh my god! <laughs> so, yeah, having <laughs> cheap thrills. But please continue with your very nice mod. So yeah, so it was lovely. Like I really liked it. And mm. the music, every point that the thought got a little too serious. or got a little too like what's like okay like you know as the music kind of kept it light mm-hmm. so every time the thought got too heavy the music made up for it and suddenly like you know with that little guitar play and that little whatever balance. that kept coming yeah so the balance was maintained so well uh, that at no point did it uh, make it too overwhelming or too overbearing mm-hmm. wo nahi hua which is which is i guess the the work of all the elements that you're putting into a song right otherwise why else would you be using a certain element you're mm-hmm. using it so that the entire song you know balances itself out so which is great mm-hmm. so it was it was a acha song i wouldn't say it is the best song yeah it's a good nay we heard a lot better but after a long time akele aawaz sunna aur jo ke like you know just ikatthe mm-hmm. sunna it was very pleasant it was lovely it was very nice and it was i think ye wale level ke jo gaane hai na ye ab young stars ke liye bahut hi matlab like you know they very like makhan malai like it's too easy it's too easy for them mm-hmm. like you know i think sote sote aise gaane bana dete honge you know what i mean like when we listen to these songs and i'm like yeah like this is their zone itna to basic unse expected hai so yeah i i overall basically i what i'm trying to say is i really liked it uh, i like the music i like the words i like what was being spoken it gave me a pause it made me think yeah. and uh, that's that yeah yeah um TY kept it real man as always yeah. um yeah. like super real i b- before i get to the song and what are my thoughts while it was on um the music jokhe we we discussed this in the last reaction as well jokhe is going into like different soundscapes where he is yeah. um i feel like he's not just experimenting that's a given but he is um really focused on creating a visual almost experience with the sound in the tracks mm. which i'm mm. finding very interesting because this this like the whole guitaring and the whole production of it kind of took me into like i don't know sitting by the beach or sitting in a park like just very nature i don't know why i was just getting very nature vibes from me because uh. it's raining here uh but <laughs> okay <laughs> it was it's always raining it's just raining <laughs> so um so that props to jokhe cuz every time he's producing something we are hearing a different yeah side yeah. of his talent and he's multifaceted as a musician i mean uh, we've known that for a while given his background and all the stuff he does loved it loved it so i think ty got a really nice um playground to to fit this emotion of his into um yeah. and then what i noticed through the lyrics of this song is a lot of shout outs to older songs and older lines mm-hmm. of his and older verses of his own um yeah. many many places pe you know like uh, taro se kar, um, karu baat then the whole syahi something line was there uh, zindagi uh-huh. then the, like i was like was was this from afsane was this from this song was this from this song like that happened many times through the mm-hmm. lyrics and that line ki you know um kaash mein maj- uh, uh, mashhoor nahi hota like izzat badi par sukoon nahi i love first of all sukoon sukoon is one of my favorite words um <laughs> like top 10 so lovely so yeah. yeah so that whole like bada uh, sukoon nahi is like very uh, it just it just hit me and then mm-hmm. uh, at one point like you were saying you you focus so on the lyrics and what he was saying at one point i was so focused on what's happening with the guitar um uh, strumming and right at that moment when i was focused more on the music um and his voice was in the background for me right there i heard him say ki dhyan do main jo bol raha hu <laughs> <laughs> and i was like oh, how did he do that <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I was like, "Oh, sorry, T.Y. I'm I'm back. I'm listening." I'm listening. <laughs> oh, that's that's actually that's such happened. A, that's such a moment. That's a moment that happened. Amazing. Yes. <laughs> uh, so I was like, "Oh my God, is he watching me? What is happening?" Uh, 
anyway, I loved it. It was real. Uh, there are many, many. Like the thing is, um, I won't say it, like you said. It's not. Um, it's not about. Um, you know, we ha that we haven't seen the side of Tala. Um, Eunice. He's he's yeah. gotten very emotional and real and all of that before. But yeah. I feel like something's in the air because this kind of like contemplation happens at a certain. It's not that it's in the air or it's the season. It's just that you know when you reach a certain point in your career, these thoughts are natural. And and what right. um uh, what like I think I'm saying this in the forty reaction as well, and even Divinsky. Um, there comes a point where the fame and all of it which hit you in phase one. Um, yeah. kind of fades away into the reality of what else it brings into your life, you know. Yeah. And then yeah. those thoughts start developing, and and then you evolve as an artist and come out with lyrics like this, where you're really like, I always wanted to be famous, but what else yeah. has it brought to my life? That is correct. That has not that has not elevated it. It's kind of left me feeling akela, or it's kind of left me feeling like I don't have peace. Um, yeah, and it's those. Boring. Yeah, and that is one of the main reasons I feel so strongly for artists and like my heart really goes out to them because one, they choose a life of uncertainty, which is so courageous. It's such a courageous yeah. thing to do. It's just just the fact that they choose to lead a creative life which doesn't have a steady paycheck every month is in itself commendable. And then the trials and tribulations and the things that they go through if they find success and if they don't find success, whatever it means to whoever, you know, um, yeah. It's just the journey itself is so beautiful to follow. Um, yeah. And so kind of like, almost like, <laughs> I don't know if it makes me feel sad, but it makes definitely makes my heart go, go out to them. Yeah. Um, yeah. So dealing with fame or dealing with not getting fame or then dealing with people, uh, the bigger you get, the more uh, negative jealous vibes you have to deal with and then yep. you can put on a brave front and be all tough about it but at the end of the day you do have those lonely thoughts and like what was this all really worth it so anyway there's like so many thoughts and emotions that they go through on a regular basis I feel like man how do they do it <laughs> but big more power to them to deal yeah, with it and for giving us art out of it mm. correct correct and so, this is what happens right new spirals new growth patterns and mm. this is what ca then character develops because of it and that's why one person becomes different from another and how they choose to deal with it because otherwise at the end of it log to same hai na hum sab same hai lekin our experiences is what sets each one of us apart and how we choose to react to that experience so which is great now i look forward to going forward now that certain level of uh, you know, jo, uh, jo celebratory, like whatever, that dumb, which they have received. And mm. now going forward, that now that this thing that is set in, ab kaise badlenge gaane? Mm. Because ho gaya na, enough talking about ke hum yahan se aaye aur humne itna struggle kiya aur hum pehle sare gaane was about that. Then after a while, it was like, oh, sare jo piche padhe hoi hai and people who are like, you know, who are uh, two-faced and jo muh pe aise se bol rahe hai. Then uh, that phase comes. After that, the... I'm enjoying the adulation phase. Then the phase, what am I missing out? Now I wonder what the next phase will be. So it'll be interesting that now these basic stages, now once all this is gone, that yeah. then the real, like, under se or kya niklega. So I really, really look forward to that. Yeah. Very nice. I yeah. feel I feel like because uh, the, the genre itself um, started at this phase, now those yeah. number of years are over where that, that first generation or, you know, I don't know, second, one and a half generation is moving into phase two. And then the newer people are coming in slowly, getting encouraged. Yeah. By, you know, you, you're seeing the progression yeah, yeah. of the generational yeah. uh, thing happening. Yeah. I like it. I like it. So let's see what <laughs> phase two Fun. brings for these guys. Yes. And uh, loving the vibes from TY and Joke Hey, what music? I love it. Uh, I'm going to focus now on only the music <laughs> when I listen off. <laughs> and uh, TY will not doubt. Uh, okay. Chalo, on that note. That was the hilarious high point of today's reaction. <laughs> I was like, oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, let me know yeah. what else we should get to as Paula's there on Instagram. Do, 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 do. That's how you support the channel. We'll see you in the next one. Live long and prosper. Bye. Bye.